I had to warn my little sister which teachers to avoid. That's what a teammate told Brittany Roll, who graduated a decade ago from Babylon High School. She said that's how she knew it was time to send this eight-page open letter to the Board of Education, documenting years of sexual abuse from her track coach. He sat me down on the bleachers just days after graduation, and he said that he wanted to take my virginity because no one could love me like he did. And I remember just freezing. Last week, Brittany flew from Florida to speak at a school board hearing, naming at least four current teachers and six former staff accused of sexual misconduct. While the school board said they would independently investigate, the New York State Attorney General is now stepping in. In a statement, the state's highest law enforcement official said, the reports of sexual abuse of students at the hands of their teachers and coaches are troubling and must be investigated. My office is launching an investigation into the Babylon School District over these disturbing allegations. Varsity tennis player Darcy Orlando Bennett sounded the alarm when her tennis coach tried to kiss her, but she said school officials didn't do enough to protect her. The outcome of the investigation was that he was taken off as a tennis coach and he's still able to work at Babylon High School as a special education teacher. The next year a new coach was on and I quit playing tennis. I started drinking heavily and became addicted to drugs. I spiraled into a deep depression. As a parent, when you send your kids to school every day, you're entrusting those you're leaving them with to take care of them, to make sure that they are safe. Lawmakers want students to know they're trying to make it right. Brittany's goal is to make parents and other students aware of predators operating under the guise of school safety. And so if we could only kind of get those, expose the playbooks so that students and parents can know what to look for, then I think that is a silver lining to the, to the mess of this. Um, and that remains my biggest goal is awareness for students and parents because I'm jaded now. 